Welcome to my channel. Today I have the unboxing and review of Dario Argento's film Tenebra. For the first time in 4K, brought to you by Synops Films. Now this film came out February 13th, 1987. And it stars Dario Nicolodi, Anthony Franciosa, John Saxon, and Christian uh, Borromeo. It might be wrong, but I think it's Borromeo. Correct me if I'm wrong. And um, basically the story goes with this film is um, visiting Rome on a promotional tour for his new novel. Writer Peter Neal, played by Anthony Franciosa, is pulled into a murder mystery as someone familiar with his work begins a series of killings. While the police look into the crimes, Neal investigates on his own, aided by his beautiful assistant, Anne, played by Daria Nicolodi, and a tenacious young local named Gianni, played by Christian... Borromeo, as a murder brutally dispatches of other victims, Neil gets closer to discovering the psychopath's identity. Okay, let's unbox this. Now this comes in three formats. One is a limited dual format edition. There's a Blu-ray version and two 4K. One is the original version, the Italian. One is the American version, basically, which is the um, Unsane version, which is the one that I watched. And again, you have the original version, which is, you know, the Blu-ray. This has some great extras. It was a great interview here with them. Um, going blank here. With Daria Nicolodi. Which she's passed away in, I think, 2021 or 2020. She passed away, unfortunately. But yeah, it's got some good um, interviews, some um, commentaries, etc. You know, let's open it up. And here we have the 4K, the 4K, and this behind here is the Blu-ray version. And of course, like most of these movies, they have different artwork. Let's turn this out. I prefer the other personally. I think it's a little more mysterious, a little more shock value. Let's see, here we have some cool little cards from the movie. comes also with a lovely poster, which is nice quality by the way, and it is two-sided. Great artwork as usual. And the flip side is the um, Japanese poster, which I think is pretty cool. And it has also, uh, where is it? Oh, a wonderful booklet, which tells about the movie. A lot of fun facts. These booklets are always great. They're very informative on these films. This to me is one of my favorite uh, Dario Gento movies. It goes away from the supernatural type stuff that he does. It goes more into like a real storyline, basically, which is a nice departure for him. This to me is probably one of his last, I think, great movies. That's my personal preference. Now in this movie, the color red, it plays an important part in the film. If you see it, you'll understand. Now this film has a little bit of grain since it is 35 millimeter, but the grain doesn't affect the quality of the movie or the viewing whatsoever. In fact, the transfer, the 4K of this movie, that was superb. It was really an excellent job on this. 
I had this originally in um, Blu-ray version. I thought it was pretty well done on Blu-ray, but the 4K really just pops out. I mean, the reds pop out, blues pop out, the whites are vibrant. And I love the night scenes. The night scenes are shot very beautifully, really clear, really colorful. I mean, really nice job on this transfer. One of his best, I think, of this film so up, up to date. Now, um, as far as the audio, some of the scenes, it wasn't very um, loud, I thought, personally. Then, boom, you heard this music, and it just it's so loud. That's how his movies are, you know, but um, the soundtrack was pretty good. It's kind of um, reminiscent of Midnight Express, kind of that... 80s Euro kind of feel music they, with the Italian like you know flair to it but the soundtrack was great for this film now as far as picture quality in this movie I went for me will get definitely an A plus they did a superb job on this I mean I was really impressed I can't tell you enough about that if you haven't seen it in 4k you have to get it now the audio I'll give it a, a B plus I'm being kind so yeah that's my review of this wonderful movie if you haven't seen this if you like bloody movies or a fan of Dario Argento, this is a must for your collection. And uh, yeah, um, please like and subscribe to my channel, and uh, I look forward to seeing you soon. Thank you.